Some of his MPs might be shopping for a new leader, but Lawrence Springborg is still giving the Premier Curry for her sneaky change to the way we vote. She lost her political innocence. She threw out everything she said she believed in. Labor is a house divided. It's dumped police minister telling the Australian she wouldn't comment on the voting changes, but people have expressed concerns about being forced to give their preferences to parties or candidates. They don't want to. It just goes to show, ladies and gentlemen, how bad it is in the Labor Party when Joanne Miller has become its conscience. But launching a new Lego attraction at Dreamworld, the architect of the government's vote switch said everything is awesome in Labor land. I was reminded of some of the blockheads and, and brickheads that, that might be in the LNP who sort of uh, get all excited and hot and sweaty about a, 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 a voting system that they in fact voted for. Some city-based members of the LNP are worried donations will dry up, especially after Lauren Springborg said Labor's rigged it so they'll win the next election. In the meantime, the opposition leader is promoting the benefits of cycling on his Facebook page. He didn't even work up a sweat, I certainly did. His enemies couldn't resist pointing out that some in his party think it's time he was on his bike. Shane Doherty, Nine News.